another weekend of unrest. Police and protesters clashed across Hong Kong. Protesters threw bricks and Molotov cocktails, and police responded with rounds of tear gas. Numerous arrests were made. The protests were inflamed by a ban on masks. Muslim leaders invoked emergency powers last week to impose the unpopular ban, which many people ignored. As the protests continued, authorities shut down train service across the city. Protesters started a fire outside the Causeway Bay metro stop. Nearly five months in, the anti-government protests have grown increasingly violent. China's state-run People's Daily newspaper said there is an urgent need to restore order in Hong Kong.